And hello to you from a city that's never short of style. I'm talking, of course, about the French capital, Paris. We're at the Pat de Pass. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Inter. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. Must be! Well, fantastic reflex action. And now the delivery. And they could face difficulties here. Tremendous block. Oh, a vital interception. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. And what a magical save it was! Now sending it in. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Hakimi. Now with Hakimi. Well, beating his opponent. Well, then there to tidy up. Martinez. And he takes it on. That's a routine take. And that's great work to keep it in play. Mbappe. It's looking promising. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Barella. And now De Frey. Barella has it. Dzeko. Arturo Vidal still passing it around with authority and a goal to give them the lead they have their reward of the highest order. Neymar. He's failed to hold it, Neymar. And the attack going through Vidal. Options galore. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. He's driven in the corner. Well, not cleared away completely. Martinez on the last touch off the defender so a corner coming up and did his job defensively a sloppy pass outfoxing the defender 
Over the touchline for a throw-in. And they have possession again. Chalanoru. Dzeko. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. And over it comes. And still dangerous. Well, able to survive that attacking push. And Inter might be able to cash in here. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Let's see about the delivery. Able to deal with the threat. And another corner. Can they take advantage of this one? Well, not the greatest header, but astute defending. Well, mopping up defensively. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Dzeko. And fine goalkeeping. And he's fired over the corner. Well, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Well, I must say, he acquitted himself well under pressure. Excellent challenge. Vidal. Dzeko. Martinez. And now Perisic. And the keeper will happily collect that one. Able to skip past his man. No foul. PSG advantage. And the keeper grabs it. Oh, what's he gone and done? Neymar. Gay. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. And well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. The defender put in the challenge, and it might be a red card. And a red card it is. Denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Well, as soon as he made the tackle, he knew the outcome. That's an easy decision for the referee. He plays it short. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. Well, uh... So back underway here, and the big question from a PSG point of view, can they battle back? And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Dumfries. Barella has it. Vidal. And it's with Dumfries. Dzeko. Oh, good save. Well, they couldn't keep it. Dzeko. 
He read the situation defensively and did his job. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. And the advantage is with PSG. And he might be through here. But it was such a fluent attack, but they couldn't apply that finishing touch. Well, not the finish he was looking for, but there's another example of their ability on the counter-attack. Of course, stats don't always tell the story, but on this occasion, they certainly do, because they haven't been good enough in the top third of the pitch. And I'm not sure we're going to see anything change here. Very good reading of the game to win. Opportunity it is. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Short corner it is. Martinez. And hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. Neymar. Well, a wasted opportunity. It would have been a decent chance, but offside the decision. Vidal. It's with Milan Skriniar. This is Vidal. De Frey. Barella has it. Martinez. A oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. Delivering it. Foiling them effectively. Bodies forward and the break looks on. All hands on deck. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Dzeko. Martinez! Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. And over comes the corner. Well cleared away. Options in the middle. Throw-ins given. Vidal. Martinez. It's in! They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look-in. Well, a second goal for them here. Barella, Martinez, oh he's given us away inexplicably, and that's the hat-trick, tearing apart this defence time and again, they simply can't handle him. Well here it is again, and it's really poor defending, they just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. 15 minutes left for play. Could play it in. This looks more than decent. He got a good palm on it. And breaking at pace with Menace. Well, what a brilliant save that was. I can't believe he's kept that one out. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Neymar. Mbappe. Well, a powerful effort, but he couldn't quite keep the shot down. And as the second half draws to a close, I think we've got to give high marks to Inter for this performance. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement... Oh, wait a moment, Stuart. Look at what's happening.
keeper getting the touch. Danger averted for now. Jekko. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And return to Jekko. Well, able to close down the short. Straight offside, but only just. Substitution time it is here. Five minutes to go. Mbappe. No pressure whatsoever on the keeper. Martinez. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Oh, he's through here. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Jekko and a really good diving stop and he's fired over the corner well oh, they couldn't take advantage of the chance Perisic Martinez oh incredible save and he snuffed out the danger and over comes the corner not the result from the set piece they were looking for and that will do it. The referee brings this match to an end. Inter entitled to be happy about this because they picked up maximum points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects.